Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I sure appreciate you stopping by. Got a special treat for you today. I know there's a we've been we've been doing the RV thing for well over a decade now, and and we see a lot of a lot of things, uh, and some of them we find kind of entertaining, and some of them we find kind of disturbing. Uh, on this journey, we are on a journey to North Carolina, and we have seen some stuff, and we're and we're going to talk about some of that stuff right now. And one of them, and it's it's how to back a motor home. It's not as hard as you may think it is. It's really quite simple. And actually, we're gonna Yappy is gonna learn how to back a motor home. She's never backed Trudy into a into a campsite. And so we're gonna learn how to back the motor home. Stay tuned. Give us a thumbs up. You got this, girl. First time's a charm. <laughs> All right. First thing you want to do is make sure your mirrors are aligned so that you can kind of see where your back wheel is. <laughs> Get rid of the dog because the dog doesn't help. We'll do that on both sides. There will be a lot of edits on this video. Yes, there will. <laughs> but that's all right. There's a lot of editing on every video. All right. All right, now we want to make sure. Now, we're fortunate enough that we have a camera that serves as a rear view mirror. So you want to make sure you can see the out of that clearly. Yeah. Okay. Now, you're going to pull forward. And we're, we're very fortunate that the way this side is laid out, which is why I've recommended that we do this exercise. So really all she needs to do is continue around the curve until she can see the power pole in the mirror. So did you hear what I said? Yes. You pull forward until you can see the power pole in your driver's mirror. Okay, let's have some fun. Uh-oh. Don't worry about it. Looking good, looking good. It looks good right there. Cut, cut your wheels to your left, just a little bit. Cut your wheels to your left. Other left, there you go. Well, don't rush. Don't worry about them. Straight, straight back. Okay, straighten up. Straighten your wheel. There you go. Straight back. Take it to your left. Take take the front of the, the coach to the left. There you go. Straight on back. Now straighten up. You're doing good. Use your mirror. Watch where that wheel is. You want to make sure you're, you stay on the pavement. Don't rush. Now straighten it up. Straighten it up. Straighten it up. Straight, stay back. Straight, straighten your wheel. Straighten your wheel. Your turn. Which way do I need to turn my thing? Turn it back this way. Right. To me. Jeez. To me. There you go. Okay, now go hard the other way. No. Keep, keep going. Come toward. Turn your wheel toward me. There you go. There you go. Hard, 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 hard. Set it tight. I'll see it. Now you see That's it? That's why I see it. Yeah. I, just, I can't see the, the mirrors are kind of odd. 
All right, ladies, this, this is totally doable, but the first time is definitely getting your perspective. Okay, straighten it up. No, you're not straight. There you go. There you go. You're doing good. Good job. Keep going back. You're going too far that way. Straighten your wheel up. A little more. There you go. There you go. Doing good. Okay. We're going to go back. So with the spotter, spotter's job is to make sure you don't run into the creek. And you want to make sure that, that if you're the spotter, you're staying in clear line of sight of the driver. And you want to make your, your hand signals well defined so that the driver can understand. This doesn't tell the driver anything. Make it a very obvious what you want the driver to do. And as you work as you work together as a team, it gets easier. All right. Now we know how to back a motor home. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by Dude RV. If this is your first time, I'd be honored if you'd consider clicking on that subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, thank you. That's why I get to see stuff like this. You guys, thank you for that. And for my patrons, you rock. Y'all come back now, you hear?